YouTube, what's going on, man? It's your boy, Bulba, and welcome back to another play review on the channel. I hope you guys are having an incredible day. Up next on the list of play reviews, we're going to go ahead and check out one of the goats of world football. It's none other than Cristiano Ronaldo. Ronaldo is an 86 rated card. He has the controlled acceleration type, right footed with five star skill moves and four star weak foot. We don't see any versatility with the card as he can only play the striker position. And if we go ahead and look at his in game stats in a bit more detail, we can see that the card does have the potential to make a really good striker at the start of FC 25. Now, he does have 77 pace overall with 73 acceleration and 80 sprint speed that isn't great for a striker so i would probably recommend a chem style to get the most out of his pace the ada shooting by far is going to be the standout stat for the card he does have 90 attacking positioning and 87 finishing with the power shot play style plus at the striker position i think that the finishing in and around the box is going to be very consistent but his long shot should be very good as well 92 shot power and 85 long shots now the technical side to his game in general is quite decent he does have 77 passes and 80 dribbling because there's no real versatility with the card and you can only play him at the striker position the 77 passing isn't going to be that big of a deal i think in more advanced positions it still should be quite accurate maybe a little bit inconsistent from time to time but with ronaldo man you just want him to get into really good areas and have him convert the chance now just like in fc24 the 80 dribbling is a bit of a letdown for the card because he doesn't have the greatest of agility and balance it's really nice to see that he does have five star skill moves definitely adds a little bit more going forward and then he does also have 87 reactions 86 ball control and 92 composure so hopefully that can help out with the lower agility and balance just a little bit and then last but not least boys the 77 physical for the card i mean he does have 94 jumping so there is going to be a little bit more variety going forward if you do like to cross the ball i think that aerially he should still be very good especially with the aerial play style and then he does also have 79 strength and 62 aggression i think it's going to be very interesting to test out just how strong he is on the ball and with the way that the card is set up in terms of chemistry styles if you do want to go ahead and run him at the striker position where he just gets into like really good areas and converts chances i do think that the hunter is probably your best option but if you're a little bit worried about his passing and dribbling the engine is another really option to go ahead and give him it's honestly just going to come down to how you want to incorporate him in game in terms of play styles he does have seven different play styles the power shot play style plus is a phenomenal addition for the card and i don't know about you guys but i feel like the power shot play style plus is really op this year in fc 25 it's very easy to score in that way and then he does also have the power header flare tricks Trivella, Acrobatic, and Aerial. As always, boys, if you guys do enjoy these FC25 player reviews, go ahead and do me a huge favor. If you guys can, leave a like on today's video and also consider subscribing to the channel if you are new. It would be greatly appreciated. This is the team we're going to be using in Division Rivals to test out the new Ronaldo card. We're going to be playing him at the striker position in the 4-3-2-1 formation. So without further ado, boys, let's go ahead and jump into game number one and let's see how good this card really is. All right, boys, here we are jumping into game number one using CR7 in Division Rivals. Now, I will say, man, I'm actually really excited to test him out. Although there are some areas to his game that are lacking just a little bit. For the start of FC25, I think that he can still make a really good striker in game. Now, first things first, you guys know how we like to start off every player review, and that is by testing out the car's dribbling, not the greatest of agility and balance. And you can most definitely feel that in game, and he isn't very smooth on the ball. All right, boys, not a great start to the game, but let's see if we can get a few more bodies forward. As you guys know, it does have the trickster, and then also the power shot play style plus. And the power shot play style plus this year in FC25 is so effective. Honestly, boys, if you can get him into really good areas like that, I would honestly just recommend to use that as much as possible. As a keeping the pressure up, boys, it's a bit of a scrappy start to the game. Can put it onto his weak foot. Four star weak foot. It's a really nice finish. And honestly, boys, that is the best way to go ahead and use him. Get him into those areas and just have him convert the chance. Should be a very clinical player, especially with the Hunter Camp style. I just got a little bit of space. I'm going to signal him to make that run. We need a little bit more support in these situations. Ronaldo, a little bit of hold up play. It's not bad, boys. I mean, like the left stick dribbling isn't anything too crazy. It does take some time getting used to, but it can be quite effective sometimes. Power shot. It's another lovely finish. Oh, it's a bit of a loose touch from the center back. We'll take that. Otavio, I might actually whip it in. He does have the aerial play style. It's not the greatest of crosses, but aerially should be very good. And that's going to give you a lot of variety going forward, because if you do like to cross the ball, you most definitely can. Yeah, that's good recovery speed right there. Risky pass, but it's worked out for us. That was a little bit tiki taka. I might actually test out his passing a little bit more. We got Vitinha making the run. It's gone to Otavio. It's not the greatest of passes. And in those more advanced positions, sometimes it might be a little bit inconsistent. Nice, good pressure. We got Eze in a little bit of space. Ronaldo, again, picking up a very advanced position with that player role. A little bit of left stick dribbling. I might try to go for the trickster. 
into a power shot. We didn't create the greatest of angles, man, but the power shot playstyle plus, again, very difficult to defend against. I mean, in that situation, even the trickster skill move that we did use wasn't ideal, but it's worked out for us, so we'll take it. Ronaldo again, decent left stick dribbling. We're just going to try to move the ball a little bit more quickly in the final third. Oh, boys, that's a lucky bounce right there. We'll take that. Five-star skill moves, a little bit of left stick. Yeah, boys, right there, a little bit clunky on the ball. I really tried to beat the bo uh, both of the defenders, but, I mean, he's just a little bit slow in the turn. Ronaldo, I could signal him to make that run and maybe just try to go over the top. Yeah, we timed that perfectly, boys. That is so difficult to defend against. We'll take that. Ronaldo, decent acceleration and sprint speed. The center back almost caught up to us, man, but another really good finish. And as you guys saw right there, if you can break the defensive line with that over-the-top through ball, it is quite difficult to catch up to him. Tonali, I might try to carry the ball forward with him, Ronaldo. Again, man, we could go for that over the top through ball. Over the top. There it is, boys. I mean, we timed that perfectly. Cristiano. The touch right there is really nice. We'll take a free kick. Reverse it. Ooh, that's not bad, boys. Ronaldo, a little bit further back. Touch. Can we get in front of the fullback? We can, but he does get a bit of jam right there. Cristiano. I tried to go for a skill shot, but it didn't come off, man. In some situations, he is a little bit of a jammy player. He will get, like, the benefit of the doubt. Tonali, big tackle. We are going to get to it as well. Cristiano with the touch. The power shot play style plus off of the crossbar, man. Very unlucky. All right, boys. Here we are jumping into game number two. And so far, so good. We are coming up against Saliba, Rodri, Kamavinga, Kingsley, Coman, Griezmann. It's a very strong team. Now, as of recording the video, he is currently going on the market for roughly 25,000 coins. And for the start of FC 25, that's a pretty decent price for him. Brozovic, Brozovic, and Cristiano Ronaldo, the Al Nasser link up. We'll go for a power shot a little bit further out. It's off of the crossbar, man. If you are struggling to break down your opponent, I mean, that's always a good thing to go ahead and use. We do still have possession. Just going to try to move the ball a little bit more quickly in the final third. Nice, Cristiano. Good attacking positioning. The step over isn't half bad either, but he did read it. As you guys know, aerial playstyle with really good jumping as well. So aerially, you should be able to score a few goals with him. It's not the greatest of crosses. Finesse shot inside of the box. We should be scoring, man. That's unlucky. Eze, we need you to make that run. Matson, great ball. Ronaldo, the target, man. It's a lovely run forward, and it's a lovely finish, man. That's exactly what we need him to do. We haven't seen much of it in game number two, but that's another really good finish. Cristiano over the top into Matson. It's not a bad ball, man. That's things you love to see. Matson will go for the shot. It's a lovely finish as well. And that's a little bit of versatility with Ronaldo. If you do use him as like that target forward, you can also create a few chances with him. Cristiano, it's just slowing it down a little bit. Tiki Taka, as a very tricky on the ball. Ronaldo, trickster, into a power shot. He actually got the block, man. If he didn't get a touch to that, I think we find the back of the net. Tonali, see if we can maybe break that defensive line. There we go. Cristiano is making the run. I'm going to just try to drill it into him. It's not a bad ball. Ronaldo up against Saliba. Fake shot. I'm going to go Trivella. It has to be a goal, boys. That's what I'm talking about in those more advanced positions. He is just so good. Although he is a little bit clunky on the ball, the finishing has just been so, so good. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That is us using Cristiano Ronaldo in a few games of Division Rivals. And I will say, man, a very solid striker in game for the start of FC 25. Now, if we go ahead and dissect his in-game stats in a bit more detail, we did go ahead and give him the Hunter Kemp style. And with the Hunter Kemp style, he does have 81 acceleration and 88 sprint speed. And I feel like this early on in FC 25, it is very important important for your striker to be very quick in game and for the most part Ronaldo wasn't the quickest of strikers but wasn't very slow either now the ADA shooting for me personally boys was the standout stat for the card with this four star weak foot and the power shot play style plus a very clinical player in game with the hunter camp style he does have 94 attacking positioning and 95 finishing the finishing in and around the box was very consistent but his long shots with the power shot play style plus was very good as well and if you do find yourself a little bit further back with him I think that his long shots are really good to go ahead and incorporate like I said boys the power shot play style plus this year in fc 25 is really op and i do highly recommend that you guys go ahead and use it as much as possible now the technical side to his game in general when it comes to his 77 passing and 80 dribbling was decent in game i think that his passing for the most part was quite accurate maybe a little bit inconsistent from time to time but as you guys saw in some of those highlights you can most definitely grab yourself a few assists with ronaldo there is a little bit of variety in the attack now if you do prefer your smaller more intricate type of players the 80 dribbling is not gonna feel very good in game because he does only have 
have 76 agility and 61 balance. In some situations, the five star skill moves is a really nice bonus for the card. The trickster can be quite effective as well. But when it comes to left stick dribbling, when it comes to R1 dribbling, Cristiano Ronaldo is quite clunky on the ball. So definitely keep that in mind. But if you do want him to feel a little bit better on the ball, you can always go ahead and give him the engine chem style. That's most definitely going to help out with the technical side to his game. And then last but not least, boys, the 77 fiscal. I love the fact that he does have 94 jumping in the aerial play style. I think that aerially he can most definitely get the job done. And then with his 79 strength and 62 aggression, not the strongest of players in game, but not the weakest either. Overall, boys, I'm going to go ahead and give the card like an 8, 8.1 out of 10 rating. I really enjoyed using him at the striker position in the 4 3 2 1 formation. Now, with Cristiano Ronaldo, I do think that he has to fit a specific style of play. If you do want him to just get into really good areas and convert the chance, he's best at that. If you do run him as the advanced forward when it comes to player roles, I think that he most definitely thrives in that position and he can most definitely bag you a lot of goals. Like I said, boys, with the Hunter Kemp style, the pace is quite decent in game, but the finishing is phenomenal. A very clinical player and probably one of the most clinical players in FC 25. Although the physical side to his game isn't anything too crazy, the technical side is really good for the start of FC 25. If you are looking for a striker that can bag you a lot of goals and that is very clinical in and around the box, I think that Ronaldo is a great option and I would highly recommend him. But that is going to be the end of today's video. If you guys did enjoy it, let me know by leaving a like. Comment down below what player you guys would like to see next in another player review. And then also consider subscribing to the channel if you are new. It would be greatly appreciated. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for clicking on today's video. I've been your boy Booba and I'll catch you guys in another one very, very soon. Peace.